Approximately 1.15 a.m. on Thursday, the 8th day of December, 2016, police received several 911 calls reporting that someone had been shot in the parking lot of the Western Star Sports Club, also known as Dandy Town, on St. George Road in Pembroke. Armed police officers responded and discovered the lifeless body of the son, Jerry Berkeley, lying on the ground. The EMS personnel attended and conveyed the shun to the King Edward Hospital, where he was pronounced dead shortly after arrival. The murder of Deshaun Berkeley is the sixth murder of 2016, and on behalf of the Bermuda Police Service, we extend sincere condolences to the family of Deshaun. Deshaun is 30 years old, and he leaves behind a two-year-old son and an eight-year-old daughter. The Bermuda Police Service has launched a murder investigation team to investigate the circumstances surrounding the murder of Deshaun, and we are appealing to you, the members of, the, of our community, to assist us in capturing his murderer and bring to justice those that are responsible. Deshaun was murdered by unscrupulous and cowardly persons. The investigating team is aware that there was a party taking place at the Danny Town Club that night as a memorial to Gary Fingers Can, who was murdered in December of 2009. We are also aware that there were close to 100 friends and family members of Gary Can that were there as well. Those persons that were in attendance, we, the investigating team, would like to speak with you. You may have witnessed a disturbance that took place at the club that night, or you might have saw activity that raises your suspicion. Any information that you have on the circumstances and events that took place before the shooting murder of Deshaun Berkeley, we would like to speak with you. Your information is invaluable to this investigation. The investigative team is also aware that there is a picture of Deshaun Berkeley taken shortly after he was being, after he was shot and sent around on social media. We condemn this behavior as it is morally reprehensible, grossly offensive, offensive, and highly insensitive to Deshaun's family. The investigative team would also like to thank members of the public that have come forward so far with information. To date, five men have been arrested in connection with this murder investigation, and all men have been released on police bail pending further inquiries. The investigative team would also like to speak with businesses that have CCTV footage in the areas of Serpentine Road, Pitts Bay Road, uh, St. John's Road, and Bakery Lane. The investigative team would also like to speak with persons that have information concerning an incident that occurred on Court Street sometime around the 8th of October 2016 involving the Shun Berkeley and other men. A forensic pathologist will be arriving shortly to conduct a post-mortem examination, and the family of the Shun is left grieving and wondering why he was shot and murdered. The Shun's two children will never have the benefit of seeing their daddy again or having him watch their graduation ceremony and seeing them grow and mature. We as a community have a responsibility to his family to see that justice is served. We are asking you, um, community, those that have any information, that they can make contact with me, the Senior Investigating Officer, Jason Smith, on 717-0864, or email at jsmith2 at bps.bm. Any questions? We've heard reports that shots were fired. Would that indicate there was more than one shooter? No, um, from the investigative uh, team, I can tell you that there was one shooter, um, but there were many other men involved, we believe, uh, in conjunction with that shooter. Time-wise, this was after the party was over? Yes. 
the, from my understanding, the party started to wind down at about 1 a.m., and this shooting took place somewhere in the region of 1.15, uh, 1.18 a.m. Have police determined whether this is gang-related at all? I think that there is the, um, there is a smell of that, that uh, this is gang-related, and that the persons who are involved, in particular in his murder, uh, are members of uh, a gang. There's also a suggestion that um, Mr. Berkeley was targeted from within his own friend group. Um, is police aware of that? I think we've heard those rumors too, and that is the kind of information that we are appealing to members of the community to uh, make contact with us, um, if that is true, if that is the case. Do you have any description of the shooter, height, weight, skin color, anything? I think that it would be uh, perhaps too uh, premature and early at this stage to disclose that specific information. Um, we are appealing to members of the community who would have seen uh, persons acting suspiciously uh, in the area, in the bar in particular that night, um, and then any vehicles that might have been acting suspiciously uh, immediately before and then after the shooting in the areas that I spoke about just now, which would be Serpentine Road, Pitts Bay Road, uh, St. George Road, and Bakery Lane. Considering the event was well attended, lots of people there, um, why do police find it difficult um, for witnesses to come forward with information? Well, I think from experience, we live in a small community, and sometimes that might um, deter people or maybe uh, cause them to be a bit reluctant to come forward. But we must also be reminded of previous cases, and in particular recent cases in the Supreme Court where members of the community have come forward. Um, there is no information that has come to certainly police attention that they were uh, harmed in any way because of what they've done. And I think if we were to look at those examples that those persons have sent, um, their boldness, their willingness, to come forward and to assist, and, and I can tell you personally, a lot of those witnesses that did come forward, they came forward because out of conscious, conscience and also the family of the victim. Um, it is often said uh, that the pathologist will speak for the dead, and I think in these types of investigations, the police and the community also play that role as well.